Hello again, peoples of YouTube and people watching live right now on Twitch. I am Jeff of the Game Capital and thegamecapital.com. And uh, today, May 1st, I'm recording this. Uh, two new sets dropped in Cardfight Vanguard Zero. I currently have 70 pack coupons, vouchers, whatever you call them, and uh, 3,650 gems. So I can open as many as 106 packs. Uh, we're going to do a nice even 100. Uh, so 70 via pack vouchers and 30 via gems. We're going to start with at least 50 packs uh, from Banquet of Divas, which has higher pull rates on uh, the set 2 stuff. Uh, namely for me, I'm looking for Perfect Razor for Novas, and uh, all Bermuda Triangle stuff is higher pull rates and stuff in this one. And depending on how our polls go in the first 50 packs, we'll either open more of that set, or we'll open um, from Demonic Lord Invasion, which has better pull rates for the other new clans that aren't Bermuda Triangle, Dimension Police, Pale Moon, and Dark Irregulars. Uh, Dimension Police is probably the one I'd want to play the most out of those three, I think. I've never really played any of those three IRL, I don't think. So... Uh, but I have the most experienced IRL with Spike Polaris, which isn't in the game yet. I've definitely played some Nova's IRL before. I I've played some Kagro, so that's stuff I'm most familiar with. I've never really played OTT because I'm a slow player, notoriously. Just how I am. And OTT matches usually go longer. So I usually avoid playing OTT for the most part. Uh, just because cause of time efficiencies more than anything. But let's uh, not yap too much here. Minute 30. Let's open packs. Let's open packs. What do I got? Click. I'm not wearing my glasses because, uh, you know, with tickets. That button. Not wearing my glasses just to avoid the glare. We'll, we'll see if I feel the need to put them back on, but, you know. You know. So we'll be doing 10 time, and we're not doing any quick play. We're actually, we're going to enjoy this. So if you just want to see the hits, bam. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. We'll, we'll probably recap at the end showing our uh, polls of double entry players at least, but... If you want to actually enjoy the packs like I do, then, you know, enjoy the video. If you're watching YouTube in the future, you can put it on times 1.5 or 175 or 2 times speed. Go through it faster. I watch almost all YouTube videos in times 2 or times 1.575 speed. But I talk pretty fast sometimes, and I can't understand myself at normal speed. So I can't imagine what I sound like on times 2 speed. Could be scary. That could be scary. Shut up, Jeff. Open the packs. <laughs> Two and a half minutes? Okay, that's still okay. Two and a half minute introduction before we actually get to pack opening. Uh, plus the load time. I, I can't help that. I can't help that. But may our packs and our pulls be ever so blessed. Hopefully get at least ten triple rares tonight. As you should get one for ten packs on average. And in the Grand Blue event, we realized that we got the best luck by going middles. Outsides. And then the new middles. So... Uh, that stuff all looks new to me. Nothing looks fancy. We got the Grade 2 Tsukiyomi. Uh, the Grade 3 Tsukiyomi. Uh, guys of the Full Moon. That one's a triple rare. So we should easily get all the Tsukiyomi stuff that aren't triple rares. AKA not Grade 3s. Uh, probably get playsets of them all in the end. Otherwise, we can easily craft them as well. Uh, but, like I said, Tsukiyomi, uh, OTT, not what I'm, uh, targeting to play. But we'll also see what our pulls are, and that will kind of dictate, dictate what our uh, decks will look like afterwards as well. Alright, so that one is a... That's a double rare, right? Gold? I'm pretty sure that's a double rare. That's uh, Galahad. I faced one of those tonight already. Uh, so, the middle two here are old. Actually, the blue eye... Blue eyes is new, right? I think we only had the grade two red eye. And I think the gray one blue eye is new. So, Marin's the only old card we've seen so far. Zero Magnum, still haven't gotten the grade three Galahad. More new stuff. Two bunnies! Two bunnies! Airmo, I know you. Ooh, an SP bunny. Ooh. Ooh. What's our first triple rare gonna be? What is our first triple rare gonna be? There's the grade one Tsukiyomi. Alrighty. Yeah, for those that didn't see our uh, Grand Blue opening... You should watch, but uh, spoiler alert for the next few seconds here before I click. Uh, first 65 packs of Grand Blue, we got one Baskirk, and at that point we needed to pull either one more Night Mist or one more Baskirk, and I could craft the rest we needed for playsets. 66 pack they opened had two Baskirks. So one Baskirk in 65 packs, and then two in one pack. I was a little bit flabbergasted. Uh, so then we were able to craft 
one Night Mist, and one Basker to give us a playset of everything. There's another Double Rare. That one's Bermuda. There's a Razor. And there's um the Busted card, we'll just say. The most busted card of the set. But uh, this is a family family friendly channel and all that stuff, so let's let's not fixate on too much. Uh, but it is a thing. It is a thing. I know anytime uh, people ask me about Vanguard in store and stuff, like when it's appropriate to do so, like that is actually a card I've pulled out before. It's like, well, he here's here's one sample of uh, what card fight is or can be. So you know, some people love that. Some people are put off by that, depending, but. You know, there's two more double rares. So I think we've got four double rares so far. Uh, so we're doing fine there. But we need some triples. We need some triples. Is there a third airmo already? The Hollam's old. You're old and pointless. And the... I don't want to fix any of these cards, but like... So that card got printed two different times, I remember, back in the old days. This is, I think, the original artwork where... um. Do I need to say it? Like, I don't know. The the second printing or second art they did for that card was was we'll say less grabby, I guess. I don't know. All right, so flirtatious succubus. Uh, that's a new card, but not one that's got higher points in this set. So I guess that's a decent surprise, perhaps. So first ten packs, we got four double rares, no triples. So, I definitely want to see a triple in every 10, uh, but four doubles, I think I think you get three in 10 on average, or one per three packs. Either way, four out of 10 is above average, so kind of makes up for no triples there, but we do need some triples. We do need some triples. So, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Ten more. Ten more. <laughs> ba da ba da bow ba bow Oh, is it called a circle that matters? Like, I know lightning bolts can, like, strike the cards. I have not actually experienced that yet, though. Ever. So, you know. So, they're, they're in blue. Is that good? Does this mean I've got triples coming? So, blue circle, that means I should have triples? Maybe? At some point within these ten, anyway? This means tri There we go! <laughs> wow! And that's not one of the ones with boosted rates, either. That's, uh... That's... Pale Moon? No, that's Dark Regulars, right? Dark Regulars. Ooh, and the P-Guard for Pale Moon. I often confuse the cards in those two clans. They both do a lot with the soul, so like it's easy to confuse them, I think. But, yeah. Is that any good in the game right now, though? Is El Rose any good in the, in the game? That's Nightmare Rabbit. But, hey. I know you can get Sentinels with Sentinel Medals, but I still like pulling them, too. Because you only get so many medals so fast if you want to play everything ASAP. Another double. Nice. Nice. I wish you could, like, click on the cards within the opening to, like, see what they are and, like... Because I can't see the card names, and I... While I recognize a lot of the card arts, I don't know most of the names by heart. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Grade 2, Galahad. Two of you, but no, neither SP. Really? Another Marin? Another Marin? Come on, nah. Ooh! There's the lightning! There's the lightning! So, uh, we have to reveal that card last then, right? That's the first time I've noticed that in my openings. Probably an SP trip rare. Ooh. And it is... Hmm. Bermuda. And yes, it is an SP trip rare. So not what I'm looking for, but we'll take it. We'll take it. So that's two triples. So we're, we've got two and 14. We're ahead of the game now. We're ahead of the game now. All right. All right. I'm just changing the uh, Twitch title to open 100 packs now. They should be able to tell that from, like, whatever still shows. But, you know. You know. It's a good card, though. One of the sisters. Okay, that's good. That's good. So it's only we want to pull, I guess. If we end up playing any Bermudas at all. I don't think I've ever played Bermudas. I've faced them, but I've never used them. I know once when I qualified for, like... Oh, what were they called? There was, like, a shop challenge level kind of thing. 
um, years ago. Uh, what was I playing then? I think I played Azura Kaiser at that one, actually, I want to say. I think round one I faced Rosenloss, round two I faced Bouncing Bermudas, and I uh, lost that one. It was, it was double elimination, so I had to travel like four or five hours, play in a basement that was really scrunched, where if you were playing against the wall and uh, you lost, you weren't getting up until the round was over because you couldn't fit between the chairs. It was ridiculous. It was not a great time. It was not a great time. Another SP. But yeah. Uh, this game makes them neat. We're using our Perla. Da -da -da. Haven't seen... Ooh. Uh, that's... Um, uh, not Promise... Is that Promise Daughter? Or is Promise Daughter the Grade 2? I'm blanking on her name. But that's OTT. That's OTT. I can tell you that much. <laughs> I'm sure my chat will tell me quick enough. Lots of rares. One being SP. Alright, last pack of these ten. Last pack of these ten. Hail Moon. I know that card in SP IRL was always a hot commodity, to say the least. So in that 10, how do we end up with uh, two triples and three doubles? Two and three. I might just start writing this down. So let's see. We got zero and four. And then we got two and three. All right. Uh, remember the lightning bolt hitting Overlord for me was neat. <laughs> Hello, Ivan Valdez. How you doing? How you doing? Crafting materials. So we're 20 packs in. 20 packs in. Plenty more to go. Plenty more to go. I haven't opened packs in a while of not Grand Blue. Just a Grand Blue last night. Two nights ago. I think it was two nights ago. Yeah, it must have been. Yeah, it was two nights ago. Because that ended on the 29th. I think I've only seen one card for Razors so far, though. So that's unfortunate. In our circle... Is once again not yellow, which I'm hearing is a good thing. So far, we've got two triples and seven doubles through 20 packs. Come on now. Come on now. We've seen several of him. But I think he's just a common, so I guess that makes sense. Wingle! Woo! I needed you. Grade 2 Sukiyomi. And, ah, uh, I don't need you, and you have a really low pull rate. So we, we hit the 0.02% Cosmo Lord. Although, once he gets the cross ride, I hear he gets really good too. And that's my third of him. So we now have four Zura Kaiser, three Cosmo Lord, zero Brutal Jack, and of course, zero Perfect Razor. <laughs> the yellow means double rare, and the purple is triple rare. This looks blue to me. I don't know. Looks blue. Bum, bum, bum. Grade 1 Tsukiyomi. Kung Fu Kid Bolta. I know his, his name now. He feels so important. Bum, bum. Ooh, there's a Blau. <laughs> there's... Wait. Are those... One of those is a Blau. What's the other one? Maybe I do my glasses. One is a special rear guard for Blau. Okay, so they are both Blau related then. Okay. Like they both look like Blau units, but. <laughs> a little confused. A little confused. But that's okay. But that's okay. 12k minus 5k if you don't have Blau as Vanguard. Okay, I remember seeing that. I remember seeing Slash reading that. Two blue eyes, one pack. Busted card. And that's gotta be at least the fourth Airmo now. Gotta be at least the fourth Airmo. Bum bum. Ba bum. Oop, that's our second street bouncer. Which is a new card for Novas, but I feel like the, the street bouncer are going in Nova Ducks right now. You know a great one razor. We got at least two of that. I pulled three perfect razor up in around 150 packs. Woo! I mean if if I end up doing a hundred packs of just the Bermuda set, I get two raise perfect razors. I'll be pretty content with that, I think. That's at least three of the grade one. 
at least three of the grade one. I, if I pull one perk razor and then I can craft a second one, I'll be okay. But we'll see what happens. We will see what happens. Grade one Blau. A lot of blue eyes here, my goodness. Woo, bar! <laughs> it's kind of lame when you see, see the original ones that, like, most are going to have a play set of already, but... Oh, well. Oh, well. Ooh, I did it wrong. Great to use Yomi. And that's the end of that batch. Dude, that was a bad batch, I think. No doubles we had? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So we're at 3 and 7 through 30 packs. Let's see. Overall, I think there is too much stuff and hard to pull specific stuff. I, I can definitely agree with that. I can concur. I can concur. Yeah, like while they have separate banners, they aren't fully separate. Like, I, I would... Well, I think at some point, don't they do mini events where like for one to three days, you can do a banner that has only one clan in it? Or are those just the boosted ones like this is for Bermuda right now? Ten more. So this is number 31 through 40. So we're almost a third of the way through this already. Almost the third of the way through it already. Well, not already. I guess I've been going for 15 minutes already, but... Maybe I'm going slower than I thought. Bum, bum. So, blue. So we should still have a triple rear. Ooh, Bellicosity. That's fine. That's fine. If and when I play Cogra, I'll definitely want some Bellicosity dragons. I remember that being, like, the only card with value in EBO1 back in the day. Because, like, everything else that was good in EBO1 got reprinted. And it was just, like, the only thing you wanted from that set. I think it was, like, a $5 rare at one point. So another double. So now the doubles are coming back through. Now the doubles are showing up again, and we should still have a triple coming as well. There's the Grabby Sisters. And a bunny! Two SPs, one pack. Ooh. No, you have a plane circle? Oh. Does that mean I can't pull a triple rare? Or that's just less likely? That's sad. That's sad. <laughs> Man, so many busted cards. Oh my gosh, double busted card. <laughs> oh, it's so inappropriate. <laughs> That's at least the third double rare. No blue means all rares for most of time. But I got three doubles. I got three doubles. So if uh, Plane Circle means you might get Jack Squat, three doubles sounds pretty good. We had no doubles last ten packs, so... You could argue that these ten are better than the last ten when we got a triple. We've got three left. We've got three left. Ba-boom. Ba-boom. So we've got enough Grade 1 Razors for sure. What rarity is the Grade 2 Razor? Or, wait, is there a new Grade 2 Razor? Because we already had Trans Razor. Nothing there. And last one of these ten. Ba-boom. Ba-boom. Another street bouncer. Oh, well, just a rare, I guess, so. So, zero, three. Yep. No triples. Three doubles. So, through 40 packs, we're at just three triple rares and ten double rares. Whew. Alright, so we're doing at least 10 more of this set. So I said 50 for sure. Uh, but... I almost want to switch sets because I haven't pulled that great so far. But I also still need everything then, so like... Yeah. Raise your custom. Okay. And that's in the set. It's not like... In the future. I don't think I've pulled Razor custom yet. That's the great too. Ooh, that looks, sh that looks shinier and more special this time. Right? Now it's more shiny and more special. So it's still blue, but there's like a purple cloud or haze around, I guess, is what you want then. Grabby sisters. Well, I hope they're not sisters, but, you know. <laughs> Went from yellow to purple. 
I'm getting so many of that bunny. So many of that bunny. I assume that is crafting materials, officially. <laughs> yes, it is in that set. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Who's it gonna be? Can we get the perfect razor? Can we find perfection? Just like me. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I know I'm not perfect. God, am I not perfect. Ooh, that's the... Oh, what does he do? That's what? Heat Nail Salamander? I think. I think it's called Heat Nail Salamander. I forget. Ooh, another Belkasi Dragon. Nice. Ooh! That's, uh... Is that Garmore? Garmore, right? I think. That's Royals' new triple. So I actually pulled a triple rare for Royals. That is crazy. That is crazy. Because I do not pull triples from Royals, like... Ever. <laughs> so that right there is a solid pack. That right there is a solid pack. We got an SP. We got red eyes and blue eyes. We got someone Bermuda. We got what I think is a good Kagero card. I think that's that sees some play at least. Belakasi Dragon, solid double rare, and a triple rare for Royals. <laughs> Ivan Valdez, eleven, did not get that card from you said a hundred one hundred and fifty packs. I mean, there's plenty of cards I haven't gotten yet either from, you know, good amounts of packs. I still have no Brutal Jack, no Silent Tom, no Cam Knights Elfred, no Gansalot from the original 100 packs plus everything we're opening now. So, I feel ya. I feel ya. Ba-boom. You got three Waterfalls, though. But sounds like the Waterfall is kind of mad in this in-game for this one. I'm used to Waterfall having extra crit and stuff, so... Smash if you didn't crack packs early on. <laughs> right, I I officially started my current playthrough, whatever you want to call it, a week after release. I think this is like my 15th day, my 15th login. Yeah, because I think I started a new 7-day stamp card this morning. So yeah, I think this is my 15th day. 15. Two more. Is, is it jumpy for you guys or just for me? Like, it, it's, it's not very fluent for the loading, but it is what it is. I can't really do anything about it, unfortunately, but... Uh, not too much, Rika. Not too much. This is our fifth batch of ten. No razors. No perfect razor yet. So that batch, we have a one and... Just one and one? And those came in the same pack. So we had nine crap packs out of that ten. So through 50 packs, we're at four triple rares and 11 double rares. Definitely could be better. Definitely could be better. But yeah, these came from the same pack. Which means their nine were a waste. <laughs> so any any quick votes in chat? Do we keep opening Bermudas? Like, I want Perfect Razor. So I think I have to keep opening this set. Because, like, the odds of me pulling enough to, like, properly play Dimension Police or something via the other packs isn't very good either. So I think we just keep going. It's probably going to be 100 packs of this set. I'm guessing. I'm thinking. Probably is what's going to be. Probably what's going to be. Any, any quick input? Any quick input? I know there's probably a, some form of delay, but, you know. Keep going, Bermuda. going with a banquet of divas of a banquet of divas is, is the lady that that launders no one wants to respond here gives you an up chance all right we got one response good enough for me so we have 20 pack coupons left and then we plan to use 3,000 gems <laughs> you want pulls until you get one razor fair fair Hopefully we can find at least one. Hopefully. Ooh, ooh. Shiny, yes. Okay, so we should have at least one chip rare, if I'm understanding things properly now. There's another double rare, okay. Okay. Ooh, and there's a triple rare right away, so at least two of our triples are Bermuda so far, which I guess is kind of expected. 
because what four of the eight new triples with boosted rates are Bermuda Triangles, so I guess that makes sense. I guess that makes sense. So hopefully that's not the only pack with good pulls, because the last time we had one double, one triple in the same pack and nothing else. So hopefully the next nine aren't all junk. <laughs> I give you my luck and positivity for a perfect razor. Well, thank you. Ooh, there's the grade three Blau, which so someone keeps telling me I'm supposed to play, so. <laughs> we'll see if we get more of him. I think that's the first one of him anyway. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Oh man. We got both of those. We got the busted card, and we got the... The... I mean, I guess I hope they're not sisters, they're just the... Ooh! Ooh! What we got? It's hot. It's hot. I can feel it. I can feel it. It was this one, right? Oh, boy. What we got? What's hiding behind the busted card? Well, it's a surprisingly good matchup against Razors. Ooh. I'm going to not look for a second. What do we got? What do we get? Is it good? Is it good? Really? The one triple rare I have four of? Uh, that's got what? A 0.02% where the one I want is like 0.18 or something? So we got more materials. Azura Kaiser loves me. What can I say? <laughs> I thought that was going to be an SP one with the lightning bolt, though. I thought it was at least going to be a second SP one. But no. <laughs> well, actually, will that be will that be converted materials automatically or no because I have an SP one? It's probably not automatically converted, then. I may, I may have to get rid of my SP one, though. I don't know. There, there's two SPs. That, that's two good SPs to get. They're not the high rarities, but those are a couple playable cards in SP. That's something. That's something. Oh my god. I would say so many more things if I wasn't a G-rated family channel and stream and stuff. <laughs> uh. So many bunnies. Another SP. Got three more in this batch. All right, that's our second one of that. What's her name again? Is, it's, is it Imperial Daughter? Imperial Daughter, maybe. Promise Daughter is a grade two, I think. I think this is Imperial Daughter, which I think was originally an EBL one. Wasn't expensive IRL. It's got 11K though, so I'm not. Sh I don't remember the ability offhand, but. Maybe that's decent. Maybe that's decent. Two of that dude. And one more from these ten. Got a lot of him. Grade two Blau. So how we end up there? So Kaiser does not automatically convert to to uh, stuff then. So two and three, which ties our best. We've gotten two triples, three doubles twice. The next best was the first ten with zero triples and four doubles. <laughs> so yeah, this, this is our second best showing so far. Or ties ties for our best showing, actually. Although we did not need Zero Kaiser, so. Yeah, no. We got the grade three plow. That thing may be good. Maybe good. <sighs> like, I want to look at what I've pulled so far, but I also don't want to, like, make this way longer than it's supposed to be, per se. Oh, it does really. So it has Restraint, cannot attack. Counter Blast 1 and put one of your other rear guards into your soul to lose Restraint. Uh, if you have no rear guards, it gets plus 10,000 and plus 1 crit. Okay. Okay. Right, I think I saw someone say that this is, uh, like a stall deck, basically. Hey, thanks for the follow, Temion Smash. Welcome to the stream. Came from Cluffer just to say hi. Well, hello! Hi! <laughs> Appreciate it. That way that's on the opponent's turn, too. Oh! 
dang. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I knew that. I knew that. Because I was saying, like, what do I do? Like, I can't swing into rear guards. Like, what, what do I do? What do I do? So, yeah, if you do that, basically they hit you one time per turn, and that's it. So. But at the same time, only being able to attack once when you have to attack interceptors first. Well, I guess if you play this, your goal is to make them deck out. If you play this, do you ever win via six prizes? Does the plus one crit even matter? <laughs> it's interesting. It's interesting. We've got two of them so far. We've got two so far. Uh, let's see. So yeah, let's let's keep her going. Ten more. Boom. Give, give me that. Give me that pretty circle. Give me that pretty circle again, please. So we're actually ahead. Actually, no, we're right on pace. We've got six triples and 60 packs. Six triples and 14 doubles. I didn't say 16, did I? So, yellow. So that means for sure double rare, but nothing above that guaranteed. Hopefully it's still possible. Is he new? I think he's... Is he Dimension Police? Or is he Nova? I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's a double. There's a double right in there, wasn't there? Kind of missed that. Ooh! Ooh! Has the circle deceived us in a good way? If this is another Zero Kaiser, I'm walking out the room. And I and will maybe be back eventually. Maybe. Maybe. Alright! Alright! That's my second grade one Death Army guy. Whew. I'm gonna watch this time, because not watching didn't didn't work. Our second one of her, I believe. I mean I need more Death Army units, so it's okay. It's okay. Uh, you build it around grade two, I think. You let them hit until you are left with her. And it's 21k I played one earlier today. Riv is good. Cool. Cool. Like I said, I, I've never used Bermuda, so like I'm aware of them, but I'm not necessarily familiar with them by any means. So I just know I want Perfect Razor. I, I know that's a card I want to pull. <laughs> Both sides of Bermuda are strong. Ba-bum. Ba-dum. Double Bunny! It just keeps going and going. Ooh, don't have double rare. Is that Doreen the Thruster? I know her. <laughs> Ooh, double double rares. So we've got two of the Blau, so... Maybe you're right, Zero. Maybe you're right. I may have to play the Blau's. I may have to play the Blau's. Boom. We've only seen the one P-Guard so far. I'm kind of surprised we have not gotten the Bermuda P guard yet. I forgot what he does. He looks familiar though. I recognize him. <clears throat> Pack seven of ten. Okay. One quick one. Oh, I missed one. Oh, something the missed one would be good. So we've got plenty of... Is it Heat Nail Salamander? Is that that one card's name? The 6k Kagro? I know it does something that can retire things. I forget the exact details, but... Ooh, another double rare. Uh, Uriel, I believe her name is. Princess I Uriel? Is that the full name? Am I remembering names better than I thought I did? Is this card's full name Princess I of Uriel? I'm going Princess I of Uriel. Final answer. Am I right? All right, way off. A third one of her. Okay, maybe we're gonna play that deck for the, for the uh, annoyance or whatever. And we've got three of her, and I'm sure I could craft another one. So, if that deck proves to be a, uh, a good, wow, six doubles there. All right. So is one in six better than two and three? Because if so, that's our best ten so far. That might be our best 10 so far. Still no perfect razor, though. All right. <clears throat> so now we're into the gem pulls. We are out of tickets. 
We are out of tickets. Gem time. Gem time. Ten more packs. Let's go. Let's go. Gem pull hype. Is that, is that a thing? Do you get better pulls with gems? That'd be really interesting if they, like, didn't tell you, but they gave you better pull rates with gems that were paid for. That'd probably be a smart thing for them to do, but also be kind of annoying. <laughs> get prettier. Prettier? I mean, if this match is the last 10, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be content. Thanks for the follow, Justin is fake. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good one. I'm not hearing the notifications for whatever reason, but I I'm noticing them at least, so that's good. So that's good. <clears throat> I just had 2,000 followers not too many days ago. I'm at 2,040 now. You guys have been coming through nice. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. So yeah, those watching in the future on YouTube, make sure you're following on twitch.tv slash thegamecapital so you can see stuff like this live and participate. And just, I think it's more fun that way. I think it's more fun that way. For sure. Two SP Bermudas in one pack. Overall, this 10's not feeling so hot so far. Not feeling so hot so far. But that can change fast. I don't think we've seen that grade 2 yet. We've got four of her. We've got four of her. So we have to build something with that, right? How many packs are you open? Um, I'm on my 8th batch of 10 right now. We're on our 8th batch of 10. And we've got 4 Imperial Daughters. We have not pulled a Perfect Razor yet. I think the only new triple we've pulled that's not Bermuda so far is Garmore times 1. I think. We, we pulled our 5th Azura Kaiser. Somehow. I had 4 uh, from our first 100 packs from you know before the new season and stuff. And then, you know, we got the Lightning Bolt and stuff, and it gave us another Azura Kaiser. Kaiser loves me. What can I say? What can I say? SP for, I think that was D please. Boom. Oh, I meant to get that one, too. Oh! That's Reindeer, right? I think that's our first of her? I think? So once again, we get a triple rare, even though the circle's yellow. So, ha! <laughs> and was I good on the other name? Was it Princess Eye of Your Rail? Was that the full card name? I need to know this. Was that in this 10? That was in the previous 10, I think. I don't know. Is that two street bouncers in one pack? Ooh. Another double rare. Alright, so this 10 turned around. It still wasn't fantastic, but it improved. It started slow. Okay, one and two. So maybe not as good as I was feeling, but. All right, so through 80 packs, we're at two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're at eight triple rares in 80 packs, so one in 10. Be expected. You still want to do better than that, but I guess we can't complain. And double rares, we've got four, seven, 10, 14, 20, 22. We've got 22 triples, or doubles, sorry. 22 doubles. And I think you're supposed to get at least one at, or three out of ten. So we should have two more doubles than we do so far. And that's after getting eight in the last twenty. So, yeah. Alright. Another ten. Another ten. Can we find one perfect razor? I mean, come on. I just want one anyway. Give me one perfect razor. Or is the game going to force me to not play Novas? Or if I do play Novas, is the game going to force me to play Blau? <laughs> Hopefully Blau does well with Forza or Kaiser. <laughs> Cause, or, or 5? Can I play 5 Azura Kaiser? Do I like need to, need to uh, disassemble? I forget the word. Do I need to uh, break my SP Kaiser? I don't want to. Pretty. Puppy. <laughs> Tsukiyomi. That's P. Tsukiyomi. I'm not. Have we? Did we get the puppy before? Are those? Are those our first two puppies somehow? Can't be. 
How many of that bunny have we pulled, though? My goodness. My goodness, we've seen a lot of that bunny. Nope. Nope. And is the uh, grade 2 razor a double rare? Because if so, we I don't think we've seen him yet either. There's a promised daughter, which I assume I have four of. Ooh, SP though. Ooh. All right. Yeah, I'm guessing you play Promise Star with Imperial Daughter if you're trying to stall, and then you play the Promise Star as you get them, and you can just... You can beef that on your opponent's turn, too, right? So, you know, discard three cards from hand, go to 24k on rear guard, that just hit first before you hit your 21k Vanguard. So, double rare Bermuda. Another double rare from Dimension Police. Cosmo Beak? I think? I want to say Cosmo Beak. If we didn't play this before, he's all over now. I just didn't notice him before, I guess. I don't know. So that's a decent pack. That's a decent pack. Ba -bum. Come on. Come on. Another SP. Come on, give me a triple. I know we don't have the circle we want, but give me a triple. Naked baby. <laughs> Another puppy. All right, how many doubles did we get there? Three? Just the two? From the same pack? So we had one pack that mattered. Oof. Oof. So I think that's eight and 24 now. So hopefully we get at least two triples in these last ten. And hopefully one's a perfect razor. I hope. I hope. Bless up. Bless up. Bless these poles. Bless these poles. If I if I could throw these poles on the floor before I open them, I would, but I can't. How, how do we bless digital packs? What's the trick to blessing digital packs? I have no idea. Here, I'm just gonna... Put my hands on the screen, on the circle that's circling, and just, oh, oh, may these packs be blessed with pulls, oh, may they be full of razors, oh, give me the goods! That'll work, right? Gotta try something, right? Gotta try something. And if it works... It's amazing. All right, we got the circle we want. We got the circle we want. That's a start. That's a start. Vortex. <clears throat> All right, nothing to start. Nothing to start. Give me that nice bolt again. Give me that nice, nice bolt. Oh, is that our second or third one of her? We might have to play Bermudas. We might have to play Bermudas. It's looking like that might be a thing we have to do. And I feel like I'm going to at least have to... Alright, we got one Bermuda P-Guard. One Bermuda P-Guard. I, I suppose that's something I'll need as well. The P-Guard is also, um... How we say, busted. I don't really want to play Bermudas because, like, I just feel... Feel weird playing them, you know? But, we'll see. We'll see. It's so hard to be a G-rated streamer sometimes, you know? Ooh! What's it gonna be? I, 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 I think my trick to start this 10 worked. Whew. Um. <laughs> give me, give me, give me. Okay, okay. I mean, it's my only grade 3 Tsukuyomi, but I mean, okay. <laughs> it's not a bad card to pull. It's not a bad card to pull. I can be okay with that. Uh, currently, I can craft one tripware from each of the Q4 clans. <laughs> so, not exactly a ton. Not exactly a ton. 
but I do have a place of everything gray and blue. So, there is that. <laughs> Three packs to go. Three packs to go. Of this 100 pack opening extravaganza. Two more. Come on. Can we get... Can we pull two perfect razors in our final pack? That would be amazing. I might, might fall backwards and risk concussion if that happens. Alright, last pack. Last chance for Lori. Ow! Let's do it! We've got... That card. A grade 2 12k. That's gotta have some drawback depending on certain things. Ooh! Our third Blau! I think. Is that our third one? I guess we're playing that. Did one of our packs of 22 triple rares. Must be nice. I don't know what that's like. Come on. Come on, Razor. Where are you at? Razor! No perfect razors. No waterfalls either. One Tsukiyomi. We'll, we'll, we'll look at the recap here, but two and two. So we finished with two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We finished with the exact expected 10 triple rares in 100 packs. And double rares, we got four, seven, zero, 10, 11, 14, 20, 22, 24, 26. And I think our expected pulls was 10 and 30 we did 10 and 26 so pretty darn close to what we like quote unquote should have gotten but definitely wanted better definitely wanted better so let's uh go check out our doubles and triples i think the only double triple we got that wasn't new was we got one more death army guy i know uh so that much is nice and we got a fifth Azura Kaiser. <laughs> Azura Kaiser loves us. Azura Kaiser loves us. What can we say? I know. I don't want to use all my gems. And 100 packs is just, just a nice even amount, you know? I'm at exactly 200 packs. Oh, oh, wait. And we get... Is, it, is this gems or pack vouchers or what? For getting so many cards of different clans. That's got to be what it all is, though. More stamina. 200 different types of cards for a voucher. So one voucher. Oh my god. I was going to quick claim all, I guess. Because that's going to be too slow. So... Yeah, just a bunch of vouchers. So we probably have one more pack now, basically. <laughs> we probably basically have one more pack. Seven vouchers. And then one more voucher. So yeah, we probably have one more pack, but... Um, yeah. Uh, that one? So we, we could open seven more packs now, but... I'll, I'll see how I can do with what I've got now. So we want to go search. Let's just do one rare at a time. So triple rares. Go with the big stuff first here. So, just down from the 100 packs, we pulled the Garmor, right? Garmor is your name, right? Right, this is Garmor. Why is it everybody's load so slow for me? Fane of Light Garmor. Okay, during your turn, this unit gets plus 1,000 for each of your Snogle and Rugal. When placed, discard a card from your hand to call a Snogle from your deck. All of your Snogle and Rugal get intercept. Okay. Are they. Is one a grade two already anyway, or are they both grade ones? Not sure. I'm gonna go this way, so I actually have the cards like show for me. Had that, had that. So that one's new for us. If your soul has six or more cards, count blast two to draw two cards and put a card from your hand into your soul. 11k base. Had those. Had that. Had those. Had three of those and one of those. So yeah, if I deconstruct, we get 50. So, but we still need all the other materials too, like, it's only worth half a triple rare only on the highest gem, so like, I know a lot of people say just deconstruct your SPs and stuff, but like, 
it's really pretty. And, like, I don't get that much ahead by doing that either. So, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, we, we did get a third Cosmo Lord as well. We got a third Cosmo Lord tonight from the 100. We had two in our first 100 from the OG. Uh, Edel Rose is obviously new. If Werewolf Seeger is in your soul, counterblast two to get plus 5,000 and plus one critical on end of turn. Uh, from hand, return this card to your deck to add a Werewolf Seeger from your deck to your hand. Okay. So, like, I feel like you don't often want her as your Vanguard just because she's 9k base. But she can at least help you maintain intercepts to an extent as well. So it kind of basically increases your uh, your grade 2 count. And it it's a trigger that you can get back in the deck as well then. So, uh, yeah. Obviously had those and those. Uh, so we got an SP Pearl Sisters Perla. So pearly. When this unit's attack hits a Vanguard, you can Soul Blast 1. To return one of your other rear guards to your hand. That's a grade 2 9k. Works on rear guard as well. We got two top idol Riviere. I know that's the standard legal Riviere is really good. They had to nerf it a little bit. Uh, IRL. You have super idol Riviere in your soul. This year gets plus 1,000. So I believe it's 11,000 uh, on both players' turns then at that point. When this unit's attack hits... Persona Blast to have three of your rear guards get plus 5,000 until end of turn. Now I feel really stupid asking this. What's Persona Blast again? Is that like get rid of all of your soul? This your tech hits. The three of your rear guards get plus 5k until end of turn. Persona Blast. Like, it sounds familiar, but I'm blanking. This card, same card from hand. Okay. Okay. Like, I've definitely heard that before, but like, what the heck does that mean? <laughs> Alright, we got two Velvet Voice Reindeer. When your drive check reveals a grade 3, return a rear guard to your hand to call a card from your hand to an empty rear guard. If those who don't know, Bria Triangle always has a lot of bouncing. And that's the end of Ship Rares. Uh, Ivan Valdez got 44 doubles and 14 triples from around 150 packs. So yeah, you're you're basically the same pace as us then. You're basically one triple shy, and I'd say one. Well, no, I'd say. Let's see. Well, 50, 44 doubles. If if you're supposed to get three doubles per ten, you would get 45. So yeah. I'd say you were very close to right on pace. I'd say you're just slightly below expectations there. So we got our five of our ten triples were Bermuda, which is kind of expected. That would be half of that. Two of our triples were old Nova Grapplers, but not Perfect Razor. And then we got the Edel Rose, and the Tsukiyomi, and the Garmore. And then for Double Rare. Oops. Ah, jeez. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm such a such a bad quick clicker there. Oh my god. Let me see my double rares. I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry for that. Please forgive me. Magnifying glass. Double rare. Confirm. Alright, so. Uh, new from these hundred packs, we got the only the one Galahad. We got the four Imperial Daughters. So I'm gonna have to build that. And is your name Prince? What did I say? Princess? Princess Eye of your Rail. Evil Eye Princess your Rail. I was close. I was pretty close. When placed, if your soul has six or more cards, choose a random card with the least grade from your opponent's hand, bind it face down, and return it to your opponent's hand at the end of the turn. Ooh. Ooh. So, uh, choose a random card with the least grade. Now, if it wasn't automatically computer happening, like, IRL, how do you randomly choose a card with the requirement that it is of the least grade? Like, you can't be like, uh, this one. Oh, that's not a great one? You have a great one? Okay, pick again. Like, 
you would have to look at the hand, take all the grade ones, and then put those face down, shuffle whatever, and then pick one of those. So it just, it is interesting. Like that terminology requirements that doesn't work IRL. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. But yeah, in theory. So yeah, if you're facing OTT and you think they have this, you kind of like almost need to keep uh, at least one grade one in your hand that's not a Sentinel or you risk the Sentinel. You have a higher risk or a guarantee of the Sentinel getting binded. So that's interesting. And yeah, this one's really interesting. It can be 21,000 extra crit on all turns. That is interesting. That is interesting. All right. Uh, what else is new? We got two Bellicosti Dragons. That one, when it hits, you counter charge one for Kagero. So that's a card that Kagero definitely wants to play. Definitely a card that Kagero wants to play. Uh, this thing's new. Amber Dragon Eclipse for Kagero. If Amber Dragon Dusk is in your soul, it gets plus 1,000. Counter Blast 2 to get the following ability until end of turn. When this unit's attack hits a Vanguard, retire one of your opponent's rear guards. Uh, we got our second Death Army guy. We got three of the grade three blouse, so apparently I'm gonna have to play that one way or another. Just for you, Zero. Just for you. One Cosmo Beak. This unit plays kind of blast two to have one of your other units get plus four thousand. And I got minus half zero. So if Blau Kluger is in your soul, gets plus a thousand. When this unit's attack hits a vanguard, you counter blast two and discard two cards from your hand to stand all of your units in the center column, so the one behind it and himself, and draw a card. This unit loses Twin Drive until end of turn. So you Twin Drive and you hit, and then you Counter Blast to this card too, and then you can attack with that in the rear guard again. You draw a card from the ability, and then you still get a single drive. So you don't really lose the cards in hand. You just swap two for two, basically, right? I believe, if I understand it right, you discard two. Like in the end, I get you Counter Blast two. Yeah. And so yeah, Flau Cougars in the soul, it's 11,000 on both players' turns, I assume. Just 11k base just seems... I definitely like... For my Nova deck, when I don't have Azura Kaiser Vanguard, I don't like it. I want to have 11k Vanguards. Unless I'm playing Kagero and I need Blockade out there. But other than that. Um, during the Thruster, when your card is put in your soul during your main phase, this card gets plus 3,000 on a turn. Doreen the Thruster can get really beefy. Can get really beefy. Uh, March Rabbit of Nightmare Land, so the Sentinel for Dark Regulars. I was thinking that was the Pale Moon one. So Pale Moon is... Uh, I always confuse the units in Pale Moon and Dark Regulars. I just always do. I don't remember pulling Glow Beast Tamer, honestly. So Restraint can't attack as a 10k grade 3. Soul Blast 2 to lose Restraint. During your turn, all of your front row rear guards get plus 3,000. When this unit is placed, call a Chimera from your soul. Yeah, Pale Moon has a lot of soul shenanigans. Dark Riders uses the soul as well, but yeah. And then Chappie and you and you. So we got three Pearl Sisters per lay. When this unit was placed, when this unit was placed, one of your Pearl Sisters, Perla, gets the following ability until end of turn. When this unit's attack hits a vanguard, soul charge one and draw a card. Draw power. P guard. One super idle revere. Didn't we get two of the grade three revere? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, one girl's rock Rio. When you turn to your hand, counter blast one to soul charge one and draw a card. And we got three Bermuda princess Lena. Lena? During your turn, if you have four or more rear guards, it gets plus 3,000. Only as your vanguard, though. When placed, return all of your rear guards to your hand. And that is it. So, that is what we got um, from 100 packs of the uh, Banquet of Divas set. So, hopefully, you all enjoyed. If you're watching YouTube, Twitch, I'm not going anywhere. Sit tight. I'll be at YouTube. Thanks for watching. Make sure you're following on twitch.tv slash the game capital for more Card Fight Vanguard Zero content as well as Pokemon Rebel Clash box breaks. Maybe other breaks coming soon as well. Uh, we shall see. But uh, also subscribe and rock, rock smash that like button and visit thegamecapital.com for your physical training card game needs and some Pokemon codes as well for the digital world. 
Uh, no codes for Vanguard, though. At least not yet. At least not yet. But Bushy Road, put codes in packs, and then I'll go crazy. I'll go crazy in a good way. Thanks for watching, YouTube. See ya.